All right, guys, so in this week's video, we're gonna be making this linen closet. So let's jump into this build and make it happen. For the first step of this project, I gotta take all the hardware off. This used to be an old bifold door closet. So I got the track and I got the pivot on the ground. So that's coming out. And then I'm gonna start building this box out right here. This is gonna be decorative. And then there's gonna be two doors here on hinges. So let's get right into this build. I'm gonna be using pine for this project. So I have some measurements. I'm gonna be making the frame for that bottom section first, the decorative part. So it's gonna be, I think, 31 and a half by 30 inches, and then it's gonna be three and a half inches wide. So let's build the frame first. complete so what I'm going to be doing now is filling this up with tongue and groove paneling and also some crossbars kind of like barn door style look so I'm going to be adding blocks in here so that the tongue and groove can rest on it and I can shoot it on so let's we'll start installing all these blocks around the perimeter Okay guys, I finished up shooting all those blocks on around the perimeter of the frame. So what I'm gonna do now is put all the tongue and groove paneling in here. I have five boards to shoot on. So I'm gonna start shooting them on right now. Guys, the panels are on. So now what I'm gonna do is take these two sticks, do an X, and put it down on the board. So what I'm gonna be doing is cutting these pieces to fit perfectly inside of this panel to give it that more architectural look. So let's get this done. Made all those cross pieces so these fit in perfectly. I'm gonna take these out though because I'm gonna burn the face of this and then I'm gonna stain these and then shoot them on. So. Let's start burning this thing with a blowtorch. Guys, I just finished that piece I just made. I brought it in the house, I fitted it up, but I'm gonna be adding a ledge to it, so I'm gonna be cutting that right now. That sill piece fit inside of the linen closet, so what I'm gonna be doing right now is building a frame for the two doors, which are gonna be tongue and groove panels stuck together and screwed from the back, making doors out of tongue and groove boards. And I'm gonna be using um, soft closer hinges right here. So let's start building that frame and get these doors on.
so all those pieces are cut for the frame that are sitting right here. So what I'm gonna be doing now is screwing and countersinking. First countersinking, then I'm gonna screw all the corners together perfectly. And guys, this is all scrap lumber, so this right here is painted on this back end. This is stained on this side, but it doesn't really matter because it's a frame, you're never gonna see it. And we're gonna finish this off with a nice stain inside because I sanded all the inside pieces. Frame is built, screwed together, all ready to go for making the doors. So my dimension is 28 and a half inches. So I'm gonna be taking these panels right here. These are tongue and groove panels I made on the shaper a while ago, but I'm gonna use them right now. So I'm gonna be putting these together. Sorry. Like so, making doors. So let's do it. guys so what I'm gonna do now is flip them over so this is already flipped over I'm gonna be taking strips just like so and screwing it down so that it doesn't move on me then I'm gonna be finding where the hinges go and start assembling and installing the hinges so let's make these doors start swinging Okay guys, so I got both doors in the frame ready to go. So what I have to do now is, as you can see how the door is kind of belly down, I'm gonna put a stop on uh, just the top of the jam so that when you close it, it's all flush, everything's good. I'm gonna start staining all this, getting it prepped, sand it so it looks nice. It's gonna be an uh, early American stain. It's a lighter, lighter color. Then I'm gonna start installing some hardware. So let's finish this thing and make it happen. I have everything stained ready to go. I'm gonna be taking this furniture wax right here. It smells like sweet honey, and I like the way it smells. Honey, 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 honey. So the panels are all waxed, ready to go. I have the frame wax also. I also installed some handles to the doors. So what we're gonna do right now is take all the pieces inside, install it, then I'm gonna come back out in the shop and make some casing. So let's go. guys installation is complete so before I shot the frame on I had to make sure everything was plumb and square 
Now that everything's in, I'm gonna start making the casing in the shop, so let's go right now. up that linen closet project it turned out really nice if you guys enjoyed this project please drop a like on this video and also drop a comment below on what we should build next so please subscribe and i gotta get to the next project so stay tuned and let's roll that outro